hello lovely people welcome back to my channel to my new subscribers i see you and i appreciate you thank you for joining the family and i hope you'll stick and stay with us and continue to enjoy the content i'll be bringing your way today we'll be working on a very easy recipe and it's waffles i hope you all agree with me that these make your breakfast look so fancy and the good thing is they are also very satisfying come along with me let me show you how to whip this up in just a few minutes first thing i'll do is go in with some flour which i've already measured out and then to that i'll be adding some granulated sugar i'll also add some baking powder and then i'll give that a mix i almost forgot one ingredient and it's salt so i'll go in with that right now and then mix that up and set the dry ingredients aside now i'll work on my wet ingredients i'm going to start that off by measuring out some milk and putting that in my mixing bowl i'm using almond milk for this recipe i'll also be adding two eggs some melted butter and vanilla extract i'll give that a good whisk and then i'm going to transfer the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients and then we'll continue from there now that that's done we'll make sure we mix everything up but the plan is not to get this as smooth as possible so it's perfectly fine if you end up with some lumps in this mixture my waffle iron has heated up quite a bit at this stage i'm going to go ahead and grease that with some cooking spray and then i portion out my butter into the waffle maker okay so make sure you grease it well if not the butter is going to stick to the iron and it won't come out looking as good as you want it to fortunately for me my waffle maker lets me know when my waffles are ready but if yours doesn't just look out for the steam coming out of the waffle maker and if it kind of reduces that's your cue that your waffles are ready or almost ready so just keep a close eye on them so that they don't burn on your watch okay I'm going to keep repeating the process of greasing my waffle iron and putting in my butter till I have exhausted all the butter I whipped up. And there you have it. I ended up with three big delicious waffles. I will be leaving in the description box all ingredients and their respective measurements so please do check it out and you can always double or triple this recipe if you want more i hope you try this recipe i hope you love it as much as i do and if you did enjoy this video please do consider subscribing to my channel don't forget to turn on your post notification bell do share this video to friends and family and leave me a thumbs up Thank you all for doing this with me today. I can't wait to see you very soon in the next video. Take care and goodbye.